Hi guys, this is Goddess Gale. Like always, another day, another fragrance. And today I would like to review the one of the most famous fragrances. And this one is Coco Mademoiselle by Chanel. This one I think you all might have heard it before. I actually don't want to buy this one because I feel like I would smell like anybody else. I'm not going to smell unique. That's what I thought. But the reason why I bought this one because one of my best friends gave me the sample of this one. And one day I just feel like my room smells bad. So I use the sample on my bed in my bedroom and I go to work. And after that I came back to my home. It's like, it's so fucking insane that that smell still lasts till at night. It feels really fresh. I work. I really love it. It's like when you go to work and when you come back home and your room smells delicious and beautiful. That's how I feel about this one and I just love it. And that's my cute story. That's why I bought this one. It's such a beautiful fragrance. It's really fresh, it's really strong. On me, I think it's kind of like lasts for about 8 hours. And like I spray, spray in my room, it still lasts until night. This one, I actually don't like orange. But orange in this one is very fresh and make it so feminine. I really don't know how to say it, but I know now why people love this one. So I bought it. So let's take a look at the notes. The top notes are Mandarin Orange, Bergamot, Orange Blossom. Middle notes are Turkish Rose, Jasmine, Mimosa, uh, Y-L-A-N-G, I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce that. And the best notes are Patchouli, White Musk, Vanilla, Tonka Bean. For the first few hours, I could smell a lot of orange. And I actually don't like the orange, but it's really beautiful for this one. I don't smell a lot of vanilla, but I could smell some white musk. Oh my god. And at night, I love this one also. I spray in my room after I shower, and I just fucking love the smell. I understand now why people love it. But the thing is, this one is a strong fragrance. I remember when I used this one like seven days in a row and I end up having the headache because it's kind of strong, really strong and lasts a long time. Me personally, I love it. Love this one for the like nighttime, night out or bedtime fragrance. I know that's dramatic but it's really fresh. I love it. I think if you would like to try this one, just go try it. You don't need to think like you're gonna smell like anybody else or anything. I think it's really good and it's worth the money. It can be too strong. That's the only thing that I could say. And the packaging and everything looks really f phenomenal. I just love it. I would like to try the intense one, but this one can make me have a headache, so maybe I stop. So for this one, I'm not gonna do the bad test today because I feel like I've been using this one for quite some time and I could say that it lasts around 8 hours on me. And if you spray in your bedroom, it's gonna be delicious forever. For me, I think this one is one of the sexiest fragrances ever. It's really feminine, warm, fresh, and delicate, I would say. It's really beautiful. It's made me feel really sexy, like in the advertisement that you sleep next to a guy and you smell good till the morning. <laughs> I know that's stupid, but it's really beautiful and feminine. So that's it, guys. My review for Coco. Mademoiselle by Chanel. I challenge you guys to try it out to see if you love it just like I do, just like a lot of people do, but I'm not gonna fuss you. I'm gonna stop blending and hope you guys enjoyed the video 
Don't forget to like it. Thank you so much for watching.